Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we have a new word. And also, I changed the format a little bit again. And you, you can notice that I added a pronunciation guide and some phrases. So, this word is cobweb. But, but by, by the way, I th think some of you might be wondering where do I get these words? Well, either I randomly think of a word or I go to a random word generator and click, like, generate a random word and pop up, and that's what I'm going to do. So, we have the word cobweb. It's how it's pronounced. Cobweb. That's a noun. A spider's web, especially an old one. Yeah. You, you can see that this is actually the pen that I used to write in the ink, so I'll probably just use the red. Here. So it's also one covered in dust, which I don't, I can't write backwards. So okay. So it can also be. I forgot to add the words. So the B is under there, but like there's a, a as usual. This is the previous one. There's also like. Uh, a sentence, example sentence. There were cobwebs. The word is always underlined. In the abandoned house on Elm Street. And we have some synonyms. So there's spiderweb and web. They both, if you notice, they both have this suffix, which is web. And there's no anonyms because it's it, it's a noun. Well, I don't know if it's really because of it's a noun, but... <laughs> It's, it just doesn't have any antonyms. And we have a phrases. This will always be put as new if it, like, it is a new feature. Blow away the cobwebs to refresh oneself or, like, relieve. Yep. So, the phrase blow away the cobwebs means to, like, clear the mind and... Let's say to kind of reset your body from like calming down from like when you're super angry to like when you're in a calm state. So that's what blow away the cobwebs means. And that's it for today's word. Bye guys.